Shaq loses a bet to D Wade and has to show his lovely hairline. Stay tuned for this hilarious story. Hey guys, welcome to The Fumble. I'm Britt Johnson. You can follow me on social media at I am Britt Johnson. And for more sports news and commentary, make sure you click subscribe. Former NBA big man Shaq has been bald for as long as most of us can remember. I personally never remember a time I saw him with hair, except for looking back on his days at LSU. And it's probably for a good reason. When you have a bad hairline, the best cure is shaving it bald or getting some hair restoration like LeBron James did. But Shaq chose the milk dud look and I wouldn't want to see him any other way. D Wade, on the other hand, did, even if it was just for some sh and giggles. Shaq recently lost a wager to recently retired Heat player D Wade, and the punishment was to show the world what that hairline really looked like. Being the good sport that he is, and he better be since he's always clowning everyone else, Shaq did just that. And well, ladies and lads, I present you with Shaq's hairline. Let's just get it out of the way, America. I had a bet against one of my good friends, D Wade, Milwaukee versus the Heat. I said Milwaukee was gonna win by 20 in the heat one. And I said, well, what do you want me to do, pay you? He said, nah, you gotta let your hairline grow out. We wanna see your hairline looking like Kenny Smith. Oh <laughs> so my I God. Just, so I just lined it up for y'all so y'all can see where my hairline well, starts. Good. I know Shaq is a big hand and all, but that's not even a four or five head for him. That is like, that's a lot, bro. And y'all know the Twitter trolls had to come through. One tweeting, Wade said Shaq hairline is where Trey Young shoot from. <laughs> Another said, Shaq looking like he went to the Whitlock Hair Club. Shaq even actually got a compliment. One saying, I ain't gonna hold you, but Shaq looks younger with the hairline, LOL. Uh, yeah, I don't know about that one. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Make sure you tune in to our Fumble Live show Monday through Friday at 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. I'm your host, Britt Johnson for the Fumble, and I'll see you soon.